So the pictures are chosen to be displayed here in the school board room, first of all as an honor because this is such an important part of our school and our community. This is a place where not just the people that come into our schools but also political folks and uh, small business uh, owners and all kinds of community members are here on a regular basis. And secondly, it's kind of to remind all of us that work together for our students that those students are creative beings, that those students are here not just to memorize and get good test scores, but really to be developed as a whole person. And the arts are a great venue for that development of who they are. So this first piece, which was done in Lyle's Crouch by a fifth grader, I really love it because it is so imaginative and they tried and experimented with so many different things. So that, to me, is a very important part of making art is chosen by our teachers and they're looking for two large issues. First of all, they're trying to show the best quality work. And by quality, we're not necessarily talking about the most finely rendered detail or the best art skills, but really that they're thinking deeper and they're really understanding and asking questions through their art and they're exploring different ideas, that those creative thinking skills. Because we believe that while it's important for every child to learn about how to make art, it's more important that they learn why humans as a whole make art. Um, and then the second thing they're looking for is variety. We don't want to have 20 drawings that are all on a similar subject. We want a variety of subjects and a variety of media, just both visually to be interesting and because it shows the, the breadth of what we do. And to show a variety of ages as well. I love this one from Patrick Henry Elementary School from a fourth grader because it really highlights the student's individuality, not just because it's a self-portrait of that student, but also because of how they collage the background. They talked a lot about the words that make up their identity and how they see themselves. And really, we want kids not to just all be doing the same kind of art and not all trying to match the teacher's description of what they should be doing in art, but really bringing something of themselves into every piece they make.